This is Senior Pastor Larry McCord, pastor of New Birth Christian Ministries, Incorporated, located on Long Island, New York, reaching out to you wherever you may hear the sound of my voice, sending out the Word of God. I know many of you are troubled today, but you don't need to be afraid because you're God's property. And he said, no weapon formed against you will prosper. This is taken from Isaiah 54, verse 17. The only thing you can rely on is the word of God. Tune in and listen to New Birth Christian Ministries on YouTube channel. I look forward to seeing you. Greetings in the name of Jesus. Who are we to God? I would say that we are God's servants. We are here to serve God. 1 Peter, verse two, 1 Peter 2 verse 9 says, But you are a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people for his own possession, that you may proclaim the excellencies of him who called you out of darkness into his marvelous light. We are servants of God. But like he like Pastor said, many are called, few are chosen. What does it mean to be a royal priesthood? A priest is someone who introduces people to God. What does it mean to be God's possession? It means we belong to God. For you, you must be set apart as holy. You will proclaim God's praise among the nations. So being chosen will mean that God is sending you out to go and proclaim his word, to go spread the word to many people. So I believe that what are we to God? We are a royal priesthood. We are, we are God's servants. We are here to serve God. We are here to lead, to try to lead those that are blind, those that do not understand. That's what I believe that we are here to do. I believe to, we are, what we are to God, we are a, a royal priesthood, God's servants. That's what I believe. That's to me just, that's what the, the message that God gave me. And that just sums up to me exactly what God looks at us as. You being found would mean that, okay, now it's time for you to go out there to go, go help those that are lost. What does it mean to be found? Amen. You are no longer lost. There's people who is lost. And like pastor also said that, there's many people out there. We, as a, as a messenger, your job is to send the message. Not everyone may listen, but they heard you. They hear you. Those are that are called, they got the message. And the question is, are you going to answer the call? Mm -hmm. That's what it's about. Are you going to answer the call? So that's what I believe, that we are God's chosen royal priesthood to go and spread the word of God. You know better, you do better. You're supposed to do better. There's many that they know, some don't know. But once you do know, it's time for you to make that change. We cannot force nobody to make that change. But it's like giving some, showing someone something. Hey, look, this is what it, this is the way. Like Jesus said, he is the way, the truth, and the life. It's up to you if you want to follow Jesus. And what I believe God wants of us to do is to also be like Jesus. We can never be Jesus, but be like him. What did Jesus do? He came and he and God, God, God sent his only begotten son to die for our sins. For whosoever believeth in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. Our goal is to now try to help those that are lost. But you can't force them. So I believe we are God's royal priesthood. We are God's servant to go out to help many. And all we can do is try. And like Pastor said too, 100,000 billions may come to that gate. And only maybe a, maybe a thousand may reach through. But that shows you that many was called, but a lot was not. They didn't not, who, who's gonna, the question is who's gonna answer the call? But that's not up for us to worry about. It's for us to send out the message. That is our job. That's what I believe. That is my message. Amen. 
This is Pastor Larry McCord. Thank you for attending our services here at Newburgh. We appreciate your contribution and support. Please visit us here in person as well as on Zoom. May the blessings of the Lord go with you and go in peace.